Hi, my name is Brian Norton with the InData Project at Easter Seals Crossroads, and today we're going to look at LipSurf, which is a unique way to voice control the web. So let's go ahead and take a look. I'm Miko, I'm the president of LipSurf, and LipSurf is a Chrome extension that you can download for free, and it brings voice control to the web. So you can do anything that you would normally do with the keyboard and mouse on the web with your voice instead. So here you can see we're in Google Chrome. Um, up here is the extensions icon, and you can see it's disabled right now. And to turn it on, I would just, just unmute my mic. Hey, LipSurf. And now it's on. Google ATIA 2020. Scroll down. Tag. AX. There's two ways to click links. You can say the annotation name, or you can say click and then the link text. So I can say, for example, click education. Click conference recordings. Back. Scroll down. Back. Gmail. Untag. Compose. Click body. So I'll mute right now. And everything I've just shown is in the free version. And now I'll show some of the premium stuff, like this dictation mode. Dictation mode. Dear John, comma. New paragraph. Here I am dictating at the noisy conference room in Kissimmee, Florida. Period. New paragraph. Dictation still seems to work fine, despite how noisy it is in here. Well, not perfectly. It did think education. <laughs> but if, if, this, if the room was a little bit quieter, it would uh, be perfect. Uh, it is the best speech recognition available. It's using Google's speech recognition API. So it works much better than Dragon. Um, you can do anything that you'd normally do on the web. You can play YouTube videos. You can do Google Docs. You can do Gmail. And um, really anything you can think of, Facebook. So that's your tech tip for this week. My name is Brian Norton with the InData Project at Easter Seals Crossroads.